Kia ora, ho, haramai. Welcome to today's five minute makerspace. Today we're making a floating ball. Well, it's gonna be a kind of experiment. We're gonna uh, experiment with a couple of different types of balls. So if you're into levitation, this might be just for you. Let's take a closer look at what you're gonna to need today. As you can see, we've got a couple of paper plates going to experiment with two different types here just to see how they go. We've got a ruler, scissors, pen, some tape. We've got a little bit of aluminium foil. Importantly, we've got one of these bendy straws and we've got a few different balls to experiment with. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do, I'm going to apply this to both of the plates, is we're going to draw a line from the outside of the plate into the center. And we'll do that on both. And we just wanna cut along that line. What we're going to be doing is making a funnel. into a funnel like so. Then take your tape and secure it well. I'm going to do that on that one. I'm going to do the same on this one. This one's a lot sturdier, so it's a little bit more difficult to shape. And you could use duct tape as well, of course, if your sticky tape is not sticking. Just hear that start to break apart. So, actually, for this one, I'm actually going to give me five seconds and I will be back with a stapler for this one. Just like that, I'm back. So I've put some staples in this one because this is really quite rigid and sturdy. Just apply some more tape there as well. All right, so the next thing we've got to do with both our cone shapes is we just want to nick off a little bit at the top. And it just needs to be enough for that straw to fit through. So we might make a slightly larger hole, just that, because we only want it large enough for the straw to go through. So we'll do the same with this one. You may need an adult to help. Please take care with scissors, of course. And we can put a hole in that. Put a hole in that one. Now, I'm going to use the, this one first. So then we want to put the straw through the hole. We'll just have to make that slightly bigger. But we really want it to be a nice, tight fit. So we don't want to make it too large. And we don't want to crush it too much either. So you might need to take your pair of scissors and just open the hole up again if you've managed to, like me, crush it a little bit. Right, so let's pop some tape around that. Make it a really good seal. There we go. Now what we need to do is we're going to experiment with our little bowls on top of here. And so I'm starting off with this nice little pom-pom ball and we're going to blow into the straw and see if we can get it to hover in the air. Right, let's try another one. Can you 
you see it levitating in the air? Fantastic. Now we've got a Christmas decoration. That's a little bit heavy, that one. Ping pong ball. And that's a little bit heavy too. Now we're going to try our pom-pom. I'm going to cover that in aluminium foil. Make sure it's still a round shape. And try that. So how did you go? We experimented with the second paper plate and it didn't work quite as well as the original paper plate. So I hope you enjoyed that because I certainly enjoyed making that ball levitate as well. Thanks for joining us. Kakite.